What is up, YouTube? Little Nanny Bob and his mom. Back with a brand new video with the Pakistani made IWGP version 5, aka the J White Belt. Because J is the IWGP World Champion. Let's take a gander at this thing. It's not the best in the world, but you know, for 250 bucks, what do you want? Here you have the King of Sports. New Japan professional wrestling sort of logo. I mean, yeah, it's not raised, it's not great, but it's there. Take a look here. And you got the gold plating, some really crappy jewels. Need to be restoned if I keep this belt. It's a big if. Coming down the side, you got your world heavyweight banner, followed by the IWGP. The International Wrestling Grand Prix. And you got your champion, of course. Some more gems of various quality. Coming around the other side. This is a belt I absolutely despise until Jay White won it. And then, well, I had to grab it. You got some grommets on the side. You got five. You got your side plate. You got your IWGP champion, which, uh, the globe is clearly upside down. <laughs> you got another plate with the IWGP. Also, it looks like the globe is upside down. And you have another side plate over here. You determine what continent that is because it's nothing on my map. IWGP champion. And then your final globe, which I think, I think this is on Uranus. I, I, I think it's it's one of the continents on Uranus, if I'm not mistaken. Going down, you got some typical machine stamped uh, tooling. I mean, the leather's not horrific, but it's not good. They didn't put a glossy finish on it at all. You do have a belt tip on this with a King of Sports lion on there. Take a look at the other side. You got your snap box with your machine stamping, clearly. Nothing handmade on that. But overall, not horrific. You do have three stacked four millimeter plates there. You got your four millimeter, you got your four millimeter, and then you got your four millimeter IWGP. So essentially you have if you're measuring things, 12 millimeters, but I have to get out a ruler because I don't necessarily buy that, but somewhere around there. But for the money, not horrific. 200 bucks, alleged zinc plates, nice and shiny. The jewels are crap, the detailing is crap, but what are you gonna do, you know? You get what you pay for. You know, are you gonna buy a, you know, an authentic replica for eighteen hundred bucks or whatever the hell they're gonna go for when they actually make this one? Or you take what you can get. It was just a beater belt just to have around the house for display purposes. Like I said, not sure if I'll keep it, but it is there and it actually does have a little bit of a curve. Can't really make it out here, but. I'm going to see if we can get it up here. A bit of a curve, mostly up here on the wing parts. So yeah, there it is, YouTube. The IWGP version 5 J-White. Too sweet!